Hi there. Today we're going to show you how to set up your Nano S Plus. But first, if you haven't done so already, let's get the Ledger Live app onto your computer. Just pause the video here and go to the address you see on your screen to download and install it. Once it's installed, open the app and click Get Started. Read and accept the terms of use and click Enter Ledger App. Select Nano S Plus and then click the top option for new setup. Have a look through the four educational slides and click Let's do this. Take one last look around to make sure you're alone, then click OK, I'm ready. Read and click through the reminder. Then when you get to the screen, connect your Nano to the computer using the cable from the Nano box. Once it powers up, use the top button to scroll through the navigation instructions. Click the right button until you see set up as new device. Press both buttons at the same time to select it, and you'll see it's time to set a pin code. Press both buttons to confirm, then you'll see enter pin on the device. Use the buttons to find your desired digits, then confirm by pressing both buttons. Repeat that process until you set up your pin code. Keeping in mind you don't have to use all eight digits, four or more is all you need. Once you've chosen your pin code, press both buttons to finish. You'll see confirm pin on your device. Enter the completed pin one more time, then press both buttons to confirm. Your screen will now say, write down your recovery phrase. Now, as I cover this part, don't worry about pausing along the way. Just keep watching until I explain how to confirm your phrase. Then I'll give you a chance to pause and catch up. By the way, this is the most important part of the setup. The whole advantage of a hardware wallet is that it stores your private keys offline. Using apps, screenshots, or password managers to store this phrase totally defeats the purpose, so please avoid them. Just use one of the recovery sheets in your nano box or personal notebook and store it in a safe place. Okay, when you're ready, scroll right, read the disclaimers as you go, then press both buttons to continue to recovery phrase. Write each word next to the correct number on the recovery sheet. Or if you're using a personal notebook, make sure to write the number next to the word. After the last word, you can either scroll back through and check your words or press both buttons to continue, whichever you decide to do. After you press both buttons, your device will show confirm your recovery phrase. But go ahead and press both buttons to do that. Now, you'll verify each word in order. Starting with word one, use the buttons to scroll until the correct word is shown. Then press both buttons to confirm. And then you'll repeat that process for every word. After confirming the last word, you'll see your recovery phrase is set. Scroll right and press both buttons to continue and you'll see processing on your screen. Then your device is ready. Go ahead and pause here to set up your recovery phrase. All right, from the screen that says your device is ready, scroll right and press both buttons to access the dashboard. You're in the right place when you see install app on your device screen. Now it's back to the app. Go ahead and click through the steps until you get to the hide your recovery phrase screen and click OK, I'm done. Then take the short three question quiz so we can move on to the genuine check. After you get your A plus on the quiz, click check my nano in the app and press both buttons on the device when it says allow Ledger Manager. If the check is successful, continue. If not, please contact Ledger support. After your successful genuine check, click continue and go on to the Ledger Live dashboard. That's it. Your Ledger Nano S Plus is officially set up. You still have to install apps and create accounts before you can receive and store coins, but we'll cover that in another video. For now, welcome aboard and congratulations in taking the first steps of your secure crypto journey.